Hi, welcome to this video tutorial. In this lecture, we're going to talk about how to add CSS styles in your JavaFX application. So now let's create our new project. Click on File, New, Other. Select the JavaFX project. JavaFX CSS demo will be our project name. Then click on finish. Let's wait for a few seconds. And there you go, we have a new project in Java FX. So now let's try to open our main Java file. So we have here the basic components or basic codes that is auto-generated uh, auto for us. So we have the border pane, and then the scene object. We also have the application that CSS that we want to work with right now. So, so this is how to add the uh, CSS file to your JavaFX application. So you have to uh, use the scene object, and then get the style, she uh, style sheets. Then you have to add the, uh, the style sheet by using the get class, get resource, and of course, getting the resource by its file name. Okay. Now, if we try to run our project, let's try to run our project. Save first, and then run our project. So as you can see, we have here a basic window with no elements with no styles no title and all but let's try to add different components to this window and add styling for those components so first uh, let's try to add the title for this window so all we have to do is we have to use the primary stage object okay primary stage set title of course with the parameter string let us say CSS demo okay and let's try to run our project click on the run button so we have here the title of our window CSS demo now uh, again, we need to add components to this window and add styling to those components. So let's go ahead and create our new FXML file. So application, you have to right click the application package, the new other, select the new FXML document, next, and then CSS demo. Click on finish. Okay. Now that we have this uh, .fxml file, we can open it in our scene builder. So right click on that particular file and then open with scene builder. Okay. Now we have to add components, of course. Say for example, we need to add uh, label and button for our window. So let's go ahead and go to controls. Oh, first, we need to set the the height and width of this anchor pane. So click on the anchor pane, and then go to go to layout. For the preferred width, let's use 400, and then preferred height will be 300. Okay, cool. So we now have the anchor pane with the size of 400 by 300 and let's go on add different controls for this uh, anchor pane so first we need the bottom so, and so for example you want to add a label for this application so label okay we could change the size, we could change the color, we could change um, how these components look by using the uh, properties here, right? 
but one of the most common ways of uh, styling these components is through CSS. Now let's go back to our clips ID to start styling our components label and the button. So clips ID we need to add first the CSS demo that XML to our main that Java. So in order for us to do that, we need to define a parent root equals fxml loader dot load, and then we need to specify the resources or the resource that we need to use. So get class and then get resource. And of course, the file name of our fxml file, which is CSS demo .fxml. And then we need to delete this border pane at the top. Then import this classes in fxml loader. And of course, this parent class. Then delete the and use import at the top. Okay. Cool. Now we've tried to run our application. Um, click on the run project. We should be able to see the components that we, uh, that we have added in our scene builder application. So we have here the label and of course the button. Now let's start styling our label and button. Let us go to our application.css. So this is where, or this is where, you will specify the colors, the size, and all the components or all the uh, properties that you can set in your components. So for example, button dot btn and open and close curly braces. Now we have a different properties that we can set for this button. So say for example the color of the text of our button. So we need to set the text field of this button. All you have to do is press the control and space of your keyboard and you could see or you can see all the different options you can set for our button. So effects and then text fill. So accordingly, the paint used to fill our text. Okay. And then again, control space and select colors from our option. So for example, we need or we want to use the aqua color and then of course close it with semicolon. We could also set the font size of our button. So in order for us to do that, we need to specify effects and then font size, so for example, 24 pixels. Okay. Now you might be wondering what is dot btn. So this is a class selector and we need to set the class of our button in scene builder so let's go ahead and open our css demo.fxml in our scene builder application and let us set the class for our button so for that we need to go to our properties of the button so all you have to do is click on the button first go to properties and of course specify the class so we have here the style style class so for now let us use the style class so the style or the class that we set in our java code is btn so we also need to specify this class here the btn okay save your dot fxml file and go back to your eclipse ide and let us try to run our application so as you can see we have made the changes to the color of our text and of course the the size of our 
font and let us apply the same styles to this label component and perhaps we need to change the color of this font because somehow it is not readable so close the window and for our text field let us choose another color and you could also pick color by using this option the first one pick color and choose your preferred color say for example um, this one the first option and then click OK now let us also apply the same styles to our text or our label so let's define the, the class for this one as label component and for this component set the color for this as blue maybe blue this one and the size will be 30 okay let's change the class for our label and scene builder also click on the label and go to properties and set the style class label component file and then save go back to our clips IDE and then let's try to run our application okay so we can see that our, our button is now using different color but the label is not working or the styles are not working so first we need to refresh our project again to reflect the changes and then run our application as you can see we now have the label component with the blue color of the font and the button as pink so now that it is working in our window let's try to see how we could change or we could add the CSS in our scene builder also because for now we will try to open our CSS demo that if XML in our scene builder still the, the components are using uh, the default colors the default size of text so we need to add the style sheets to this CSS demo that FXML. So in order for us to do that, we need to go to preview. First, let's uh, show preview in window. As you can see, the changes that we have made in our style sheets are not reflecting here in our window. So in order for us to see the changes we have made in our CSS style, we need to add this to our preview also and then click on scene style sheets and of course add a style sheet so make sure that you're using the correct application that css from your project so in our example is java effects css demo CR, uh, src and then application and then application that css then click on open so as you can see, all the changes that we have made in our CSS are now reflected in our CSS demo. And that's how to add CSS to our JavaFX application. If you have questions and violent reactions regarding our video, please let me know in the comment section of this particular video. Thanks!